Sunday service was awesome. We had a great time, wonderful worship. Afterwards, I recorded a video for social media for the children's ministry, and so check that out right here. I would say that I like when I learn about God. That's what I like. Now can I take this thing out of my shirt? She's awesome. I told her she was going to be a big star, so she's excited about that. Now I'm going to head home, eat some lunch, before I have to be back here for our small group meeting at 5 o'clock. <laughs> Well, I made it here and I'm uh, gonna do something new today, probably tonight. I'm gonna try to do a little bit of a question and answer time during the large group time, which is something that we don't usually do, but I'm gonna try it out. There's plenty of question and answers in their small group time, but I wanted to not just teach at them, but teach them and I'm better with some interaction. So we'll see how it works. I'm a little worried because I've learned that my group does not like change. And so anytime I change something up on them, they don't really know how to respond. So we're gonna see how they respond to this uh, little tweak in our large group time. <laughs> Normally I finish my videos on Sundays at the church right after youth group is over, but tonight we left early because Janelle's not feeling well and so we had to skedaddle pretty quickly. But about the question and answer format, I feel like it went pretty well. Uh, I actually got some good interaction, got some good answers. Students who don't normally talk were talking and we were covering pretty heavy topic of forgiveness. It's a pretty cool thing to interact with them with both middle school and high school. We're both kind of interacting and talking about what it means to forgive. Even one of my small group leaders was like, hey, I think it went pretty good. So we'll probably keep playing around with that format of our large group time. It's always an experiment. It's always trying to find the right thing that will connect with students. What do you prefer? Do you prefer learning by listening? Do you prefer learning by doing? Do you like to interact? Leave me a comment below. I would love to find out how you learn, what's your preferred way of learning. And if you're interested in learning about our student ministry, I'm going to put some videos right over here that will tell you about our philosophy, the things that we've been doing, some of our events, all that kind of stuff right there. So if you're into student ministry, check out that playlist. We'll see you in the next one.